Uploading leads to campaign is a seamless few quick process that will ensure you got your best bang for your buck and you can hit the ball running. So let's go ahead and drag and drop a CSV. You will see a little pop-up show up over here. What this pop-up is representing is some safety nets that you want to work with. Do you actually want to go ahead and upload leads that are part of a global block list that are part of the CSV you've uploaded? Most likely not. So do not select this if you don't want that to happen. Do you want to upload leads that are part of the CSV you've just added that were maybe previously unsubscribed specific to this client that you're working with? Probably not. So you want to leave that open. Do you want to ignore leads that exist in another campaign? Now, if you are going to go ahead and send messages parallelly across multiple clients, then anything that is client specific, all these options over here, by the way, the unsubscribe and ignore leads in another campaign, the duplication of leads are client specific. And that is a very important and powerful factor of smart lead is everything can be allocated and restrictive on the client level to give you the performance and flexibility of serving hundreds, if not thousands of clients. In this case, I do want to ignore leads that exist in another campaign because you know what, I I've already reached out to them, it doesn't matter. You will not see this section over here if you've not integrated your HubSpot account, which is available in the pro plan. But if you have, you can easily go ahead and select that. And if you do select it, you can actually select which list you want to go ahead and perhaps, um, you know, push these leads to if they don't exist. So I want to maybe push them to, uh, I don't know, new leads, right? And then what I want to do is I want to select what this feature does over here is if I select smart lead, it gives me access to custom variables that are available in this HubSpot group. You can check out the HubSpot guide as to what these things mean over here if it is referenced to you. So I'll click save. And now what I've got over here is I've got the option to select the client. Now, is this campaign specific to the client? What you want to do is just select the client that this campaign belongs to if it does. If it doesn't, completely ignore that. It doesn't matter. The power you get by allocating this to a client is then this campaign will automatically show up in your client's view. It will also go ahead and uh, do restrictions like I mentioned in the previous steps with respect to the duplicates, with respect to the unsubscribes, as even even respect to the global block list on a client specific level. So you got that power over there. Now let's just go with two examples over here. In this situation, I've gone ahead and added HubSpot and I want to perhaps go ahead and work with this first line. And it, the first line is definitely a custom field, which I will use. And also over here, because I selected in the HubSpot section, I selected smart lead as a group, I have access to this variable called personal first lines. So that group is important to get these custom attributes. If you want to push this to HubSpot as well. So what's happening over here is we're saying these are the individual fields that exist in the CSV. I want to map these fields to relevant values within SmartLead because I want to use them as personalized first variables, right? Let's say, hey, first name and then custom field, maybe their LinkedIn URL. But I also want to take this data and push it automatically to HubSpot. That is one thing you can do there. Now, obviously, if you don't go ahead and select HubSpot over here in your settings section, then you don't need to worry and it will not go ahead and have that little option of HubSpot. We can move on from this and just click save and next, which will take us to the campaign creation process. That's another video for you to check out that will show you the full power of all the things you can do to personalize, attribute, as well as deliver high performance and high value campaigns to your leads that will convert like butter through, well, a knife through uh, a butter, Jesus Christ, a hot knife through a butter. So hopefully this piece of the puzzle will keep you excited. Have a good day and chat soon.